brain. There he goes! We're never gonna catch that thing, Eli! This is like a game to them! Oh, so that explains why this is so much fun! Tricks, court, head him off! And Pronto will bravely take the rear! Okay. <laughs> He's hard to catch now! Just imagine when he transforms! This pursuit has doomed me! We'll never make it across the chasm! We're totally gonna make it! I just put new upgrades in all our mecha beasts! Those arachnid slugs are a pain in the hiney. Yeah, but that slug also saved ours. Without the web, we wouldn't be here. No. I question your mechanical aptitude, Mr. Cave Troll. Yeah, you're like a mecha beast guru. What happened? I don't know what happened. <laughs> this wasn't my fault. Well, perhaps if you wasted less time playing the jokes on Pronto. I don't waste time pranking you. Well, actually. Ah, cave corn. <laughs> ah, comfy. <sighs> ah, sandwich. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know, Pronto. That looks like time well spent to me. <sighs> but back to the mechas. What caused them to stall on us like that? <sighs> I'll take another look under the hood. Turbo connectors check out. Power transmission is optimal. Thermocouplers are up and running. <sighs> right now, I'm stumped. My buddy Grendel's the head engineer at the Western Mech Forge, so I get service upgrades before anyone. Our mechas should run perfectly. <laughs> Definitely not supposed to do that. Can't we just take them back to the forge? They could probably figure it out. <sighs> What did I say? You know how proud cave trolls can be. He'd rather eat a toxic slug than admit mechanics defeat. Cord, you've got to go face your shame for yourself. Besides, wouldn't you be like a hero if you brought some big problem to the Forge's attention? Uh, yeah, yeah, maybe. And it is decided. Though the way may be fraught with danger, brave Pronto will guide you. To the Western Forge. Wow, now that's a factory. You see? I told you I could lead you to the Western Forge. Yeah, well, there are signs everywhere pointing to this place. Plus, 
It's like half a mile high. And yet, I found it. Beast Forge. Yeah, we're here to see Grendel. Can I help you? I'm here to see the head engineer. You're in luck. That would be me. I'm Darius Yorman, the new head engineer. What happened to Grendel? He's no longer with the company. He's not? Huh. Well, can somebody take a look at our mechas? They nearly killed us. Oh, really? I recalibrated the interlink servos, flushed out the hydraulics, even replaced the pressure seals. Hmm. Did you try jiggling the on switch? <laughs> I'm kidding. <laughs> you say these glitches started yesterday. I put in the recall parts last week and did a field diagnostic, but... Wait, wait. You already upgraded? How is this possible? I'm the advanced field tester. New parts ship out to me automatically, way before anyone else. Well, good for you. Give the mechas a level 3 diagnostic, top to bottom. Yes, sir. So, how about a tour while we wait? I'd love to see how this place works. Well... <clears throat> Grendel always gave tours. I suppose a quick walk through the plant would be okay. And all our raw materials are imported from the eastern caverns now. Over 400 tons of steel smeltered every month, and not a drop goes to waste. Don't touch that. Unless you want a wave of molten metal dumped on your head. I am happy with my head just the way it is, thank you. Handsome. Oh, cool. That must be the Mecca's heart. Beating with the same power that flows through our slugs. Beautiful, isn't it? I still don't know how they do it. Molecular transference? <laughs> that was a figure of speech. You're a pistol. So the Western Forge builds all of Slug Terra's mecha beasts? Every single one of them. Wow. I hope what happened to our mechas doesn't happen to anyone else's. Don't worry. We'll get to the bottom of this. Without mecha beasts, Slug Terra would be without reliable transportation, and everyone would have to find other ways to get around, like Dr. Black's Slug Terran Express. We wouldn't want that now, would we? You're late. The last person who made me wait became dinner for my ghoul slugs. Was there a problem with the shipment? Oh, no problem. Except me almost getting killed. I don't never want to go back there again, Dr. Black. That place is... it's unnatural. Oh, where do I find these people? Take it inside. Let's test the potency, shall we? Another fine batch. I'm beginning to think our possibilities for ghouling may be endless. So, I hope you all feel secure knowing the quality, care, and darn it, love that goes into every mecha beast we build. That's it? Aren't you gonna show us the final assembly area? Uh, closed for remodeling. I can show you kids the commissary, all the K-Berry shakes you can drink. <laughs> well, if you are challenging Frontal to break his personal shake-drinking record, I accept. There's something about this guy. I don't trust him. Bah! Anyone who offers delicious shakes is a friend to me. So what exactly happened to Grendel? He loved this job. You kids ask a lot of questions, don't you? Oh, what's down there? Just spare parts. Hey, who wants those shakes? Woo! Me, me, me! Me, 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 me! Come on, Pronto. I want to check this out. Oh, but, but the shakes! Hey, what are you doing here? 
Alpha G recording. Initiating auto ghouling sequence. They're ghouling the Mecha Beast. Black's behind this. Oh, yeah. Welcome to the future of ghouling. Too bad you won't be around to enjoy it. <laughs> Here's the commissary. And all the caveberry shakes you can drink. Wait, where are the other two? Attention! We have intruders on level eight! You're not really an engineer, are you? Don't try anything clever. Clever? <laughs> not to worry there. My partner here doesn't know the meaning of the word. I should have known my scout would lead me into a pickle like this. You forget yourself, sir. In fact, I don't think this mole could find his butt with both hands. First, fully, I do know where my butt is. Second, Divly, it would behoove you to choose your next words carefully. A molenoid can be pushed only so far. It gets worse the more you scratch. <clears throat> I suggest that we run away as calmly as possible. Ah, oh, oh. You are quite an actor, Eli. <laughs> this way. <laughs> Listen, do you smell that? No. Well, that's because you can't hear with your nose like I can. It's coming from that way. <laughs> Cleaning supplies. Yeesh. Spoiled meat storage. Axle grease. And... Ah, ah, yes. I think you may find something of great importance behind that door, my sniverless friend. Nice work, Pronto. <laughs> you just had to bart in here asking your nosy questions. Why couldn't you have just crashed and burned like everyone else is going to? You're working for Black, aren't you? Very good. Then you've probably also figured out that Dr. Black doesn't like to leave any loose ends. And that's exactly what you two are. A loose end. Tour's over! It's just in time, buddy boy. <sighs> That's not all I found. Look who was locked up in the basement. Grendel? Boy, am I glad to see you. No time for hugs and howdy do's, youngster. We gotta move fast before they send those mecha beasts out to all of Slug Terra. Grendel's right. We gotta hustle. Oh, you're much too late for that. <laughs> 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 
Uh, Randall, can you guys buy us some time? They'd like nothing better. You, with me. Okay, okay, what's going on in this place? Darius has ghouled the Mecha Beasts. What? How can you ghoul a machine? That's the energy inside the hot unit that they get at. I've seen them do it. Uh, so what's gonna happen to our Mechas? First, they start acting funny. Then they go totally bonkers. Then, boom! Those creeps made me look like a fool. Worse, they made me look like a bad mechanic. Yeah, then there's the whole exploding thing. They're going to send those upgrades out to everyone. No, they're not. We're going to shut this place down. But first, we're going to save our mechas. It breaks my heart, Fernando. But I must leave you to your explosive fate. Maybe not, Pronto. What do you think, Doc? Finish those kids! Ah! Trixie, Corn, I need cover! <laughs> My slugs aren't even scratching that thing! your mecha beast. Good for you. This doesn't change a thing. In the end, Dr. Black cannot be stopped. You're gonna feel pretty embarrassed when we prove you wrong. Yeah. Spend the time! Rosco will save you! <laughs> <laughs> what a pile of junk. This wee man. Now then, you were saying? <laughs> Fernando! I, I thought you were cured! Oh, no. Everybody run! Before he explodes! Uh, actually, that one was me. 
I was saving it for a special occasion. Oh, you and your wonderful pranks! Oh, I could kiss you! I could kiss you! I mean, perhaps another time. Doc, you did a really great job out there. Thanks for saving our rides. Oh, yeah! Oh, yeah! Oh, yeah! That's the last one. Nice work, Doc. Once this story gets out, people are going to start to realize the truth about Dr. Black. I'm just glad to see Slug Terra has a Shane once again. Oh, it was Bronto's pleasure to save the day. <laughs> One more stink blast for fun. Save it for the ride home. Done and done. What if Black tries again? My engineers are already on it. Black may have a new trick, but I can promise you it will never find its way inside one of our mechas. It seems our improvements to the mecha beasts have been discovered. Disappointing. We'll just have to try a little harder next time, won't we? That's the spirit. They can enjoy this victory, but I'm a patient man. Very patient. Increase our production. I'm going to be needing more ghouls. A lot more ghouls. <laughs> <laughs>